Hi guys, welcome to Off the Tent. My name is Chris, and today we're going to take a look at a nitro beer. That's right, a new nitro beer just showed up at the LCBO. So I picked it up. Yeah, I went and grabbed it. Um, and then I was like, oh, I wonder if Joe can get this one. And Joe did do it, and I totally forgot that he reviewed this one about a year ago. So I rewatched it. I'm excited to try this one because I like left hand brewing, especially their milk stout. Today we're taking a look at, taking a look at, sorry, of the Galactic Cowboy, the Nitro from Left Hand Brewing out of Longmont, Colorado. Um, I'm excited to try this one, so let's get right into what it says on the can and what I know. All right, so Galactic Cowboy Nitro is an Imperial Stout. It's coming in at 9% alcohol by volume. Uh, it's 44 IBUs. Um, the it is in a 404 milliliter can. Um, yeah, it's because of the nitro. It's it's as big as uh you know it's as big as a tall boy, but because of the nitro in it, it's a nitro can, so you got to pour less beer so it can nitrolize. Did I just make up a word? Nitrolize. Um. Anyway, like I said, Joe just not just he did it. He did this review about a year ago and i rewatched it and he was saying that um it's bitter uh it's not really um a sweeter stout which is fine if it's a traditional stout i'm gonna like it uh it is nitro so that's pretty cool but one thing i wanted to see on the uh one thing that i saw on the side of the of the box it does say that there's sugar I, i'm trying to see if it's on the can but doesn't say it on the can, but on the side of the box that it came in, it did say that this is using sugar. So maybe they sweetened it up. I don't know. I'm going to try it. Can't wait to hard pour this bad boy. Let's do it right now. Good old nitros. So, uh, yeah. Like my shirt. Yeah, daughter made this one. I like it. Too big though too big of a size but let us take a look at the galactic night the, the, the galactic cowboy my god i can't even talk what's wrong with me all right so it's cascading right now cascading all nice well this one this one's probably gonna take a while so as that one cascades i'm going to actually reach behind me and grab the box that this came in and give you the actual ingredients all right, because this is coming in from the States, they put this little ingredient sticker on the side of the box here. It says, uh, wat, uh, water, malted barley, oats, sugar, hops, yeast. So that's what I mean. Like it, They may have sweetened this one up, Joe, so we'll see. Uh, so it is done. Cascading, and that box is sticky. I'm just making a mess out of this review. All right, there it is, right there. Beautiful head on this. Don't even need to put it in the physics. It is a nitro beer. Looks like a Guinness. It's coming off black on camera, but towards the top of the head of the beer, it's a little bit browner. If you can see, head on this one is a khaki colored or sand colored head on it. Let's take a smell. All right, you can pick up a little bit of the stout qualities from this one. Little roasted malts on here, but and a little bit of a chocolate. Uh, scent on this one, but you can't really get past the nitro head on this because of those condensed bubbles, right? So Let's try it. It did pour off like a freaking Guinness. I can't wait to try this. Cheers. Here we go uh, Guess what it's actually sweeter than I thought it was gonna be Maybe that sugar that they added to it sweetened it up a little bit. Maybe people were bitching, Joe. Oh, this is good. Okay, let's talk about the mouthfeel on this one. It's a Guinness. I mean, it's a nitro beer, so like, I did that on purpose. It, it feels like a Guinness going down. Nitro, thick head on this beer. The body is, you know, approaching full body. It's almost at full body, like it's really close because of the nitro. It's going down creamy, smooth, all that jazz. If you've had a Guinness before, then you know exactly how the mouthfeel on this one is. It's mimicking that one 100%. Definitely a dangerous beer though, 
I mean, they're calling it an Imperial at 9%. Sure, why not? It is not giving me any alcohol astringency whatsoever. Not even any chest warming in, in every time I'm drinking it. So it's uh, it's very dangerous, as Guy would say. Um, let's talk about what I taste on this one. Now, Joe was saying everything's dialed back, and I can see where he went on that one because it is. It's dialed back with uh, with the flavors on this one. You're getting the coke, uh, the coconut. Fuck, no, there's no coconut. You're getting the chocolate. It's a, it's a bitter chocolate. Uh, you're getting a little bit of a coffee note on this one, roasted note on it. But that's about it. But it's very dialed back. I mean, this is a fantastic stout, especially nitro. I mean, so I can't wait to have them all. Um, Taste wise, it's a stout. It's a it's a well made, well balanced stout. Uh, the only thing is though, I wish that they had a little bit more flavor to them. Uh, a little bit more chocolate, maybe a little bit more coffee note, maybe a little bit more of a roasty note. Yeah, that's what I'd like on this one. Other than that, it is quite delicious. I mean, if I was going to score this, it, it would get a good mark. But thing is though. I was, I was kind of expecting a little bit more, but after seeing Joe's review on it, I'm actually a little bit happier than I thought it was going to be because it has a little bit of sugar in it. It's a little bit sweeter. Um, yeah, but there's a little bit of a drying finish on the end of it now that I'm talking and it's, trying, it's starting to dry up my palate and stuff like that. There is that little bit of a drying thing to it. A little bit of a bitterness, but very, 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 very minute bitterness on the end of this beer. Anyway, guys, I'm done with my own opinion on this one. Totally butchered this one. It just finished work, but whatever. The Galactic Cowboy, the Nitro, from Left Hand Brewing, which I've never, ever seen Left Hand show up in Canada at all. I like it. Try it out. Get it while you can. Limited quantities in the LCBO right now. I think each store got maybe 10 or 11 four packs so if you can get it get it other than that i'm done with my own opinion if you like it click the like button share it subscribe hit that notification bell and i will talk to you guys later peace out mm. bye bye